Well, this week, leaders in Montana's ranching industry are in Washington, D.C., lobbying for changes in the Endangered Species Act. MTN's Russell Nemitz is in Washington with those ranching groups. In Montana, ranchers still utilize both private and federal lands grazing allotments. And back here in Washington, D.C., as part of the Public Lands Council and NCBA Spring Legislative Conference, ranchers have been receiving updates on very important issues that are impacting today's ranching industry. And one of those back here in our nation's capital, all the way here from Big Sky Country, is Vicki Olson, the current chairman of the Montana Public Lands Council from Malta, Montana, and Vicki, a big issue that has really hit home here of late and one that's been in the news again, wild horses. Yes, that has really hit the media hard, and, but I, I, it really bothers me that they think that wild horses should be on the endangered species list, and especially that particular group. I mean, they single that group out, um, but they are not... The Endangered Species Act was never meant for domestic livestock or pets or whatever. And it's just a perfect example of why the Endangered Species Act needs some reform and modernized, as we call it. Well, it's one of those big issues that uh, not just here at the national level, but for folks back home like the Montana PLC, the Montana Stock Growers Association. You guys have been working on these big issues like this for a lot of years now, and it's important to have a presence not just back home in Montana, but here in Washington, too. Yes, I think it does a lot of good for us to come back and talk to the people that actually make the decisions or the rules or, that we have to live with on the ground. And so getting back here and we get to D.C., we're lucky all our legislatures make, make a point to be able to see us every time I've been back here anyway. And then uh, we go see a lot of the agency people and get to go quite up far up the totem pole and visit with them and tell them exactly what's going on on the ground. And I, that stuff we don't see on a daily basis in Montana, but stuff that goes on here that I think our representation here is, is awesome. Well, we appreciate you being with us and we appreciate your candidness and for sharing a little bit of back home common sense, even <laughs> though we're back here in Washington, D.C. Again, Vicki Olson from Malta, Montana. In Washington, D.C., I'm Russell Nemitz reporting MTN News. By the way, the Public Lands Council's 50th annual meeting will be held in Park City, Utah, coming up in September.